Hello, my name is Gail Morton, and I'm going to show you how to use CINAHL from EBSCO to find free health resources. Okay, so first we're going to go to libraries.mercer.edu. I'm going to scroll down a little bit so I see research guides and tutorials. I see 44 subjects. I'm going to scroll down until I see free health. Click on free health. Once again. And there is CINAHL. This is mainly for nursing. It's also Allied Health. It has dissertations and a lot of other journals. Let's just click on this. It's specialized for health related. Gotta log in. That's just using your regular Mer Mercer credentials. You can just Here it is. Okay, so I'm going to try some research terms. And I want you to pay attention to the research terms that you use because um, the terms that you use will affect your results. I'm going to put in something very regional. Sneakers and diabetes. Let's look at our search results here. I have three. You can see subjects here and subjects here, and they're calling it foot therapy, foot orthosis. So this will give you more research terms to go by. And if I change sneakers, I'm going to do footwear. Now I have 351. So you can see the research terms we use will affect your results. Okay, I'm going to leave it at footwear and I'm going to bring your attention way over here, far left. We're going to limit our searching a little bit. I'm going to click on full text. That means we have the full text of the article. Some of these articles are just abstracts. It just tells you a little bit about the article. Um, many of them are full text. So when I hit that, now I'm down to 49 results. So we are limiting our search, just using the, and I call them limiters on the side. Okay. And since you are in the health field, you can change the state. You don't want anything too old. Let's try to show how about 2010. And let's keep going. Let's see what we have with those limiters on there. I'm going to click search again so I can get it in there. That date. Now I'm down to 43. So we're good. And CINAHL also has these. You know, they'll have a list of their publications. They'll have subject headings. Um, and these are evidence-based care sheets. So if you're nursing, you're going to need evidence-based care. I'm just going to open one up. You can see it. You can browse in here, um, but this is how you care for avian influenza, and it'll give you a care sheet on how to care for a patient, someone who has all these illnesses. You can browse through and check one. If you just want to click it here, that's fine too. Um, or we can. And diabetes. Okay. And it will tell you. Okay, so, okay, let's do this one. And then I'm going to click search. And here's a care sheet. And they're evidence based care sheets. Very good. Here's a PDF full text. Okay. I'm going to bring your attention to the side over here to the right. You can save this article in Google Drive. You can print it. You can email it. Um, or there's also, you can add it to a folder. Or this one. We can cite it. Okay. So, most times, you not every single time, but most times you're probably going to use APA. And this is 
the APA citation. It didn't give you an edition. I'm going to assume it's 6th edition and the 7th one is coming. So you would copy and paste this into your paper. Okay? And that's how you use CINAHL to find free help articles and care sheets.